Thanks for watching JapsCoTech.com. I'm Jeff Lander. And I'm Mike Irving. And today we're going to show you just exactly how a manual toilet works. Now, Bob, our machinist, he did a cool cutaway on a manual pump assembly. I'm going to get behind the camera and Jeff's going to walk you through it. Let's go. So now I'm going to talk about the wet bowl operation of the pump. During wet bowl operation, the top valve gasket and the brass fitting are sitting flat, which allows the necessary vacuum to prime. Now since the manual pump is a dual action pump, I like to use a little expression to describe its operation. When the waste goes in, the water goes out, and when the waste goes out, the water goes in. So what exactly does that mean? When I lift up on the handle, Waste is being brought in from the bowl into the lower half of the pump assembly below the o-ring. During this process, water is being brought out of the pump assembly into your bowl. So again, waste in, water out. Now when I push down the handle, this is waste out, water in. So when I push down, waste is being evacuated from the pump assembly down your discharge hose line and the water in is coming from the valve cover into this upper half of the pump chamber. So now I'm going to talk about the dry bowl setting. When you flip to the dry bowl setting, what happens is the little cam finger housed inside of the pump assembly lifts up on this little brass coin or fitting. So I'm going to do it a couple of times to show you the exact motion. Notice when I flip it over to the dry bowl, that little selector level pushes up just a little bit on that coin. On the flip side, you can see how the cam swings in and out when I switch back and forth between the dry bowl and the wet bowl settings. So, just like I told you before, that little expression, all we're doing is replacing water with the word air. So, when they lift up on the pump handle, this fills the pump chamber with waste. It expels air into the bowl. When I push down, this pushes the waste out of the cylinder into your discharge hose line and brings in air into the cylinder. So again, lift up, bring waste into the cylinder, bring air into the bowl, push down, expel the waste, bring air into the chamber. So there you have it. We just showed you a quick little video how exactly the manual toilet works. That was pretty cool. With the cutaway that we made, be able to show you what happens when you bring the handle up and push it down. My name is Mike Irving. I'm Jeff Lander. This concludes this episode of Jabsco Tech. Check back soon. We'll have more videos for you.